Yes, massive welcome back to Reggae Dance Hall Vault. And today the subject we are touched upon is how much do we miss live DJs and sound systems? And can it be brought back? Are she not ready? Why she not ready? No, she not ready. Say she not ready, she not ready yet. Because the man where she a rush a drive a whole Chevrolet. In a fear house a one whole cabinet. From fear put up a time ballet. Say if she come at me a foreign clothes she would have get. Mood a fling out cabinet and buy a crisp crisp buffet. Call a television with components. She not ready, she not ready yet. Say she no ready, she no ready Alright, a them thing I me a talk about So how much do we miss them kind of vibes yeah? And can it be brought back? That is the question, you know Now, we know a stereographer do them thing with live DJs And a couple other sounds as well But when me say bring it back, I me mean in full force Where every sound of them resident DJ Will this ever happen again? Or why not the past have to just stay in the past and done with and the world will move on to newer things? People willing to explore different things. Well, if this is so, we still can't miss it, you know. Yeah, we still miss it. We still miss them kind of vibes, yeah. Cause as a youth I grew up, you know, before we start go dance, we just listen to a bag of cassette and the enjoyment we get from the cassette them. Because when me I grew up with my mother, I can't leave my yard, but me I go a dance, you know. I just the cassette them. And I did a video on growing up loving dance hall. Please check that out. Me I beg you know, go check it out. Me I go put the link in the description. So what we are saying now is, the vibe did nice them time there with live DJs. But when did live DJs started fading? And what caused it? We're going to talk about it. up now man yo a them something i will love you know all right before we start talk about when did live dj started fading out and what caused it we could talk about where we'd love about this era yeah and when i said this era i mean the 80s but me can't talk about the 80s artists them without bigging up the foundation the man them will set it the man them will start everything like Count Machoke, Lord Comic, King Stitch and them man there. Daddy Urai, Big Youth, Irai, Prince Jasbo. A whole heap of artists set the thing, you know, that the 80s can come push it a little further, you know. Because you see the 80s, where them artists they bring from 1980 up to 1989, them overachieve. That's why we love it so, you know. Yeah, man. Imagine you're going to a dance with a general echo. And when you look, you say Brigadier Jerry. You yeah, say, wait. I want to go on you, sir. Because I want a straight slackness. And the next one, a straight culture lyrics. And the two men them just come together and mash down the place. Pure niceness. You're yeah, going to a next dance, go take in the king. Yellow man. You have Chaplin. You have Josie. You say you're going to take in Volky, you know. And he's a host of artists he has over Volcano stand up. Tyan, Lee Van Cliff, Louis Lepke, Billy Boyo. So I just pay a niceness in the 80s. Especially the clash them too, you know. Because you have a set of artists over here and a next set of artists over there, son. I just pay a niceness, yeah, man. You just have see live DJs. I go at it. We miss them something, man. Trust me. 
You go say you go take in stero one. You know say you go see Stitchy, you go see Wolfman, you go see Daddy Blue, you go see Ricky Stero, Barky, Wicker Man, Zane. You go take in Jammies, you go see Admiral, you go see Chakademus, you go see Major Worries, you go see John Wayne, you go see Tolo T, and a whole heap of singer. I just saw the thing did set. Cause you go over creation, you go see Papa San, you go see Dirts Man, you go see Bunny General, you go see Lecturer, Zane. You go over Black Scorpio, you go see Trees, you go see Sassafras. So them thing that we miss, you know, the resident DJ of them. Cause if you go over Kilimanjaro, you go see Early B, Ninja Man, Amamout, Junior Cat, no artist. What about Super Cat, Nicodemus, Buru Bantan, Antenna Sap and Stero Mars. You see what I say, artists all over. You have Metro Media with Peter Metro, Danny Dredd, Damanik, Cutty Ranks, Tanto Metro. I just enough artists, man. So, when you get the drift where I try, say, say artists just there everywhere and appear niceness. Zane, what about Tiger and Brockback and Tanto Iry them from Upper Black Star? Then you have Dragon, Flower Gun and Lizard them. Big up Shabba Rankin and Little Twitch, same way. But you see, by 1989, it's like you can't see the writing on the wall, you know. And then 1990, I say, no nah, man, this now go survive, you know. The live DJ thing, like I saw it in, and me I tell you, from then on, thing just feared out. But what were some of the contributing factors towards this? One of the main factors were sounds like Stone Love, Inner City, classic, them sound the way not have a resident DJ. And it's still a do good because guest artists come from them sound and mash up the place. The only thing is that them not have a resident DJ, just music them play. So that was one of the things them we get out live DJs. And another thing was dub plates. Even though dub plates and specials were around before, you know, but during this time, 88, 89, the dub play thing take off to a different height. So a man will have a one song, and that one song them can do it for a whole heap of sound. Meanwhile, before this, when a man had a dub play, you know, he just do it for a couple sounds and call it a special. But as I say, 88, 89, the thing just take off in a different way. And the artists them look on it like, yeah, me I make a piece of money right here, so half of me one song. But in the dance now, you have an artist, him not have a boss, you know. When I say boss, I mean on the radio. But him at in the dance. And then again, with live DJs, it was like a training ground. So you see, when a man finally get a big throne, and him touch them big stage show there, him already know what to do. Him is already a good performer. Because in the dance, him a work every night. And a training. Zane. So them new artists, you know, what we say, can hardly work the stage. And I say so them not good, you know. But them not get the training like with them artists that did get We a DJ every night. So that was one of the good things with live DJs. And another factor was, I feel like some of the sound owner them could have paid the artists them no more. And it was easier just playing them record. So I more than one something cause live artists for feared with. Now the other question is, can it be brought back? Well, Irish and China go on with great things I try to restore the sound culture. We see where Jaro do them thing, Stereograph do them thing. Say what you say and do what you do Cause I've got something with <laughs> Manic Sing out because Cowda people you never can tell the future that they and hopefully we they are long enough to say in some aspects anyways live DJs can be our own sound system on a night to night basis again. You don't know when I'm massive. I go back in the vault and so forward.